everyone, this is Casey with uh, Live Scene Effects and CMB Music Productions. Got a request to do a video about the uh, live desktop, so I'm going to do that now. I'm using the American DJ ComScan LED. Um, first time I've ever had to dim the LED. Um, I wanted to dim it so it would kind of show up better on the wall because uh, uh, at least on this camera it's a bit of a hot spot otherwise. So I wanted you to, to be able to see the, uh, the gobos and be able to make them out. So um, what I've done is I've created a couple of different scenes with three different gobo changes on the ComScan LED. The, the color wheel and the gobo wheel are the same. So I've got three different gobo changes. <clears throat> and what we're going to do is we're going to switch over to the Live tab. And here's our sequence playing through as it should. All right. So what the live desktop is for is you're playing your scene back and uh, during whatever scene playback or during your show or whatever, you need to spotlight some entrance. You need to spotlight. Uh, you want to single out one of your fixtures to spotlight uh, some of the decor in the room or the doorway or something. You want to take one of your fixtures and you want it to do something else other than what you have your show's program to do. You can do that by clicking the live desktop button and then it will open this window up and show you all of your fixtures. Um, here we're just using one so we'll select that and then it shows up on the right side. You know, Just like when you're in program mode um, you know, you have all your elements over here on the right side of the screen. Uh, but currently, the de they are deactivated. So what you want to do is once you've selected your fixture and you m decide what what you want it to do, uh, you know, let's change the gobos. Let's change these to shaking gobos. So you activate the gobo wheel right up here in the upper right-hand corner. Okay. And let's... Uh, Let's make it do a gobo shake. So we'll use uh, the little try thing, and we'll tell it we want it to do that a gobo shake. So there's the rose. There's the little broken glass. And I'm just doing this just by clicking whatever I want it to do. Okay. And then when you're done. Just turn that preset off, or you can click this clear all button. Um, so let's say we want it to strobe. So I'll come down here to the shutter controls, activate it, and set strobe. Make it strobe fast. Make it strobe slow. What, you know, whatever you want, whatever you need to do. And then you can also do XY access uh, movement. Activate the XY. And let's say I want to move it down a little bit. Where'd it go? There it goes. So you can do whatever you need to do. It just allows you to have direct remote access of uh, your fixtures. So that is live desktop. If you have any comments or questions below, um, feel free to comment and post away. Thanks for watching. Oh, and remember, if you need, uh, if you're interested in LumaDesk and purchasing LumaDesk, Light Scene FX is a LumaDesk dealer. You can visit our website at uh, lightscenefx.com. Uh, we're also a dealer currently for American DJ products. So let us know if we can help you out with your light shows. Thanks for watching.